Hello there, my beautiful Sagittarius. Welcome back to another reading. It's Lorena here. If you are new to my channel, welcome to Love Lorena. I post monthly readings asking our angels for their guidance to help inspire you and motivate you, Sagittarius. So today, let's get straight into your reading. Today we are asking the universe, we're asking spirit, our guardian angel, our spirit guides, and the archangels what you need to know, Sagittarius, for the month of October. I want to ask specifically, um, I, well, I really want you to remember your divine qualities that you have about yourself, Sagittarius. So we will ask our angels today what special quality you have, Sagittarius, for you to remember and how do others see you? What do people admire about you, Sagittarius? And when I do this reading, please listen to your own heart and your own intuition about these cards, okay? What your heart tells you is what's most important, Sagittarius. So in order to clear our mind and open our hearts to receive these messages, Let's do a short meditation, Sagittarius. I will sing and play music and just close your eyes or feel free to look at these beautiful fairy lights. <laughs> Sagittarius, allow yourself to receive this music and this reading with clarity and with love. Okay, Sagittarius, let's get straight into our reading and let's, let's ask the universe what messages you need to know for October 2020 to inspire you and motivate you, Sagittarius. And also, if you would like to meditate on this song deeper or hear it once again, and if it touched you, there is actually... Um, a song that I posted. This one's Shiva Shambo, the name of our song, our mantra. And you can find it right here. I'm going to put the link so you can just click on it right now um, on this video or after the video. I will also post it at the end of the video so you can check it out. It's on my channel. It's the one with the 
thumbnail, the eyeball thumbnail. Okay, Sagittarius? All right. So Sagittarius, spirit, angels, archangels, our guardian angel. What does Sagittarius need to know? What qualities does Sagittarius have that others admire? What qualities do you want Sagittarius to remember that he or she has? Okay, three came out automatically. So let's take a look at our three cards. All right, Sagittarius, let's look at our first card for you. Archangel Raphael. Wow, there are only a few cards in this deck that actually have the Archangels come up. I think it's like maybe two two cards out of this deck, so this is very important. It's Archangel Raphael wanting you to remember that you are a healer for mind, body, and spirit. And so is Archangel Raphael. He wants you to remember this divine quality that you have within you. You have the ability to heal others, Sagittarius. You have this beautiful characteristic about yourself that you can help others heal when they are going through the darkest of times. Even you yourself, you know how to rise above turbulation, above above things that have hurt you. You know how to heal. You know how to truly value what you have and to really have hope for the future, for even now, not necessarily the future, but seeing the goodness in the present moment, even if you are going through a hard time, okay? You let these flowers bloom within you, even when it feels like you're having a hard time, Sagittarius. So let's look closer into this card by Archangel Raphael. Let's see what he wants you to remember. Sagittarius, Archangel Raphael says, well, Archangel Raphael, Sagittarius, he is one of God's holy angels whose role is to minister to God and his people. So Raphael, which means God heals, bestows divine healing and miracles to people and animals upon the earth. So look, our mantra for this card, Sagittarius, is I feel love and healing and surrender negative thoughts. So he encourages you to surrender, Sagittarius, surrender any negative thoughts and replace them with forgiveness and love. And this will encourage your recovery and honor you with inner peace. So truly learn how to open your heart and forgive others, Sagittarius. Forgive yourself so that you can find this happiness and this inner power that you have to heal yourself. Heal yourself deeply so you can share your passions with the world and you can help the world heal as well. Okay, Sagittarius? Thank you, Archangel Raphael. Let's take a look at our next card, the Peacock. Raise your standards. So this is a message that the universe wants you to remember. Now, this may have to do with a relationship. We see two peacocks here. The universe wants you to attract your soulmate, that person that will truly respect you and love you deeply. So maybe right now, Sagittarius, it's time for you to let go of any toxic energies, maybe people who are no longer serving you in your life, whether this is intimately or in other personal relationships or jobs or things that are not making you happy that you feel you aren't being true to yourself you aren't following your heart it's time for you to raise your standards when you raise your standards you truly value yourself and you truly attract what you deserve okay when you feel you only deserve something that is not bringing you all the happiness that you deserve you feel stuck and you don't feel happy and you don't feel alive. Now, truly learn to love yourself deeply, Sagittarius, because you deserve true love. 
in all aspects of your life and when you find this true love for yourself you attract this within yourself and you attract this energy to you so that you can attract the right people into your life so it's time to let go of the old that is not serving you anymore so that you can make room for the new okay don't be afraid because if something doesn't feel right in your heart right now i assure you sagittarius in the future it won't feel right either okay so our mantra for this card is i love and care for everyone i know so learn to love deeply with your heart to yourself and you can share this with others and surround yourself with others that make you feel this deep love this higher vibration so you can feel inspired to be true to yourself sagittarius to attract the dreams that you've been dreaming of and the love that you so deserve okay sagittarius thank you angels for that card let's look at our last card i love this card sensuality express your sensuality so this is showing a sagittarius that other people admire this about you okay you have something that is full of sensual energy that is sexy and confident and maybe sometimes you feel that it becomes a blur a bit like not necessarily is this a like sexual card but it's about your confidence and your inner power that you have within you that you truly have that sometimes is blocked by our negative thinking so we want you to remember that you have this beautiful sexy energy full of love and light and you have so much to offer the world sagittarius so i really hope that you enjoyed this reading if you did please remember to like and subscribe